this is this is not just for the for the people in the United States or maybe in China. This is, this is a situation like that happens all around the world because that we know that America is that because it's a it's a superpower in our in on Earth. So I think this probably will be very important to influence our daily life. So uh, okay, so let's move on to our next speaker and. She is going to talk about the representative tree of Thailand, and I think, and because she is lives in Thailand for a long time, right? And she is a, she said she wants me to introduce as her her as a freelancer, and I have, and she, uh, she because she has um, come to regular meeting for a long long time, so let's let's give, uh, give her a big hand. So let's welcome Jill. Of China. And if you see 
our emblem of China. We, it has the feature of the flower, a Venus flower. We can see how many petals does the flower have? How many petals? Five. Five, exactly. It has five flowers. So our, uh, our emblem also has five petals in, in the emblem, uh, symbolizing China. But you might be wondering, so where are the trees in Zhongchen Road now? Where are the flowers, the trees in Zhongchen Road now? So it was actually completely eradicated. It's gone because when our current government came and local people feel like those three trees, those grow trees affected, uh, affected their businesses. So when the road was widened and paved with asphalt, those those trees was completely eradicated, which is really sad. I know that. But I believe that the beauty of the Royal Poinciana has embedded in our heart. You know, we still have some Royal Poinciana left in China, in Number Road, or in the roundabout facing the Wenxue Huan National Museum of Chinese Literature. So, have you ever been this place? Yes. It's the second museum in China, right? But the main point is, have you ever paid attention to the design of the book? Can you tell me what uh, what shape is the room on the top floor of the museum? Is it a five-sided shape or a five-sided shape? And can you recall how many petals the flower, the phoenix flower has? Five. So it's also a loop. It's also in a pentagonal shape, in a five-sided shape. The architect was actually inspired by the representative flower China, which is the phoenix flower. So that's why he designed the loop in the shape of pentagon. So I hope that you have learned something. You have learned something new from this area. And next time when you encounter the Royal Poinciana, you can pause and appreciate the beauty of it. Those remaining trees still left inside them.